It really is a winner every time. It's so filling, it's high in protein, plus the beans, plus the veggies. I mean, it's so really, good. It's so really good. It's a perfect lunch staple. I could probably eat this every single day. All right, so it's time for another Good morning, awesome man. Good, Good morning, to see you, buddy. Buddy. Good to see you on this wonderful day. We have another edition of Fruity Fantastic, What Vegans Eat in a Day. So let's get started. Um, hey, so this is my favorite set of series of videos to make because we just get to eat wonderful food all day. So we're going to start with breakfast, just like everybody should have their breakfast, the most important meal of the day. And uh, I mean, I may enjoy dinner a lot more, but you need breakfast to get that staple, to get the body going. So today, it's going to be like we do every single day. It's smoothies, smoothies, smoothies. Fruit breakfast. smoothies. Bananas, blueberries, strawberries. We're going to wash these up, put them in the blender. Let's go. So all our fruits have been, been carefully washed, peeled, and uh, all, the, all the bad parts on the strawberries have been taken off, and uh, we're good to go, so let's get this party started. Alright, let's make some room in this blender. We need to free up some space. So as we can clearly see here, the berries and the bananas can mingle beautifully into a beautiful swirl of love. So now it is time to consume that love. Boom. Bananas, strawberries, blueberries. Love for the smoothie, baby. This is how you start your morning every time, guys. I mean, if you don't have this every morning, you're going to have an awesome, successful life. I guarantee it. <laughs> Alright, so it's bottoms up. Let's sit here and drink this. We've probably got another cup and a half here each. Finish this up, let's have the rest of the day. Oh, that's amazing. It's not bad, eh? Oh, it's really good. Well, every single time they're just so delicious. This is my third cup, I think, now, and yeah, it's just going down just as easy as the first one. It wasn't like blueberries, strawberries, and bananas. Like, let's just get serious, and uh, yeah, so that's breakfast. See you guys back. Yeah, lunch time. We're about two hours, and we're gonna hit you with some salad. All right, so it's finally lunchtime. I'm starving. The smoothies were great. Smoothies are out. H, what we got on the table? I feel like a bit of a Mexican day today. Okay, okay. Mexicans know how to do it right. So today, for lunch, we're going to be having a Mexican quinoa salad here, or our, 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 our version of it. Anyway. A quinoa bean anyway. salad. Anyway. So yeah, so we have a quinoa as our base mixed with onions, um, black beans, corn, cream peppers, and onion. And then we spice that with a little bit of a cumin and chia seed. And oh. it all comes together. Delicious. If you guys want the recipe on that, I'm sure we can get that to you. Jay, uh, you know, let's do it. Let's try it out. I'm starving. Serve me up, Jay. It's on the plate. So we're all served up. I'm not going to lie. Give it a little uh, salsa topping. Okay. And uh, Jay, bon appetit. No, let's do this. Let me know what you think. Quinoa. We really got. Mmm. Yeah. The bean flavor is coming through right away with the cumin. Mmm. Hot salsa. Corn, Always beans, good call. onion. Let's do this. Alright. Wow. Well, really, what can I say about quinoa except for it really is a winner every time. It's so filling. It's high in protein, plus the beans. 
Plus the veggies, I mean, you, it's so really, good. It's you so really good. just can't go wrong, wrong with me like that, Katie J. No, this is a perfect lunch staple. I could probably eat this every single day. So, we're going to be uh, good for a couple hours here, and we'll see you guys back for dinner time. That Mexican salad was delicious. It's been holding me off well. Definitely did the job for the last couple hours. Been feeling great, feeling carved up, but now it's time for the Kundalini. The biggest meal of the day, the, the meal where I get in most of my calories, most of my carbs, most we're, of my proteins. We're making fajitos. Fajitos, that's it guys. Let's just break it down and show you guys what this is all about. We got a bunch of uh, beans here. Uh, kidney beans. Oh, uh, kidney beans, of course. Uh, we have our rice, uh, two different kinds of spices. We have our taco spice and fajita spice. We have a red onion, a couple of tomatoes, a couple of avocados, of course, because I mean, everybody wants a creamy fajito. And then, uh, then we got a couple bell peppers. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna mix in with the onion, and we're gonna fry fry those up, get them all ready to go. Some alfalfa spreads on top to top it all off, and obviously some leafy greens just to make everything go down smooth. Spinach and a spring mix. So let's put this all together and get it on. Now that it's ready, now that it's all prepared, we're stacked up with the uh, with the layer with the layers of our favorites from our bean paste to our fajita mix to our rice salsa. Vegetables on top to the sprouts to the lettuce, tomatoes, avocado, everything's there. Hey, hey, can I take a bite, please? Absolutely. And I just want to say on the side here too that uh, it's amazing that people think that uh, veganism is all about uh, depriving yourself and not having um, um, all the things that uh, that you really want. I mean, this is burritos. I mean. It's so delicious. The avocado is creamy. It is the flavor from the beans right away with the rice, the avocado with the with the spring mix. Mm, I mean, what, what is that? Salsa? Oh man. I mean, we've been having burgers, we've been having pastas, we've been having pizzas, all vegan, all delicious. So, you know, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna, I'm gonna start to get this myself and enjoy it. And uh, yeah, we're probably gonna eat about what? Two or three of these. Two or three of these each. You know, bang them back. Try and get you know a couple hundred calories per. Uh, Couple hundred calories per fajito here, and I just want to say that normally we would probably have more fruit in a, in a, in, a, in a day, but this is a Mexican day. It's a fajito night, so all I know is that it's fruits and vegetables for life, and it's all you can eat for vegans.